Mayor Southup Jaffer and I'm here with our Health Officer at the Township, Stephanie Carey, and I'm here to discuss some of the concerns that the public has and the anxieties that they have around the COVID-19 virus. I want you all to know that we are prepared, that we are monitoring the situation very closely, and we are in coordination with our partners at the county, state, and at the federal level. Uh, I also want you to know our local informational site that has all the most up-to-date information, which is health.montgomery.nj.us slash COVID-19. And so if you're looking for any local information and the most up-to-date, reliable information, that's really where you should go for that. Um, and now I want to turn it over to Stephanie to discuss uh, some of the impacts that this might be having in our community in the days to come. Thank you, Mayor. Uh, everyone wants to know how this is going to impact them in their daily lives and their families' lives. And so we want to talk a little bit about a few changes we're asking people to make. First of all, practice common sense healthy habits. Wash your hands, cover your cough, and please stay home when you're sick. We may be asking some organizations to rethink their larger public gatherings. Should, can, can the gathering be done as a video conference? Can it be moved outdoors? What can we do to reduce the spread of germs in our, in our community gatherings? We're also talking to businesses and schools about how to rethink the way they do their work. Are there opportunities for employees to work from home, for staggered shifts to occur, for the way the workplace is set up to be reorganized to increase social distancing? You'll hear a lot about the term social distancing, and it's just putting some space between you and the next person over. And it's not a lot of space, as, as, little, as little as three to six feet can, is, can be enough. Extend your arm, extend, and the, if the person next to you extends their arm, if you've, got that, if you've got that much space, that's enough to help reduce the spread of germs, because it's all about stopping the spread of germs. That includes all of the other common sense information that you've been hearing, like please wash your hands, uh, stay hydrated, don't touch your face. We want everyone to stay as healthy as possible. And definitely, if you're sick, if you have any symptoms of illness, please do stay home. Uh, the other thing that I want to emphasize is making sure that we're taking care of our community at this time. Check in with people, make sure that they are doing fine on supplies, and especially since this can be just a time where people are worried and concerned. Uh, that's really the update that I wanted to give at this time. I want everyone to know that we are, again, monitoring the situation closely. We are in touch with all the relevant agencies and that all of the most up-to-date information is available on our website. So thank you so much and stay healthy.